Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Planters Cheese Balls. These are in two new flavors. These are the white cheddar. And nacho cheese. Um, it's funny because these were both bought at Kroger, but they were bought at two different times, and they're two different prices. Uh, the white cheddar were $2 even, and the nacho cheese were $2.99. And and let, maybe these were on special, maybe they but a dollar difference that's a big difference. So they may have been on sale, and I just didn't notice it. Um, so they're white cheddar cheese flavored snacks. One ounce, 28 grams, about 37 are 150 calories. Or you can eat this entire container, uh, which is 77.9 grams for 410 calories. Same same thing for me. That's actually not bad to eat this entire yeah. container for that much. Um, so keep your lid, because that's what you're gonna use to keep them fresh. Tell you what, you don't get much, if you ask me. Well, they were only $2, and you pay about that for a bag of chips. Pretty strong cheese flavor, mm -hmm. which is unusual for um, a white cheddar. I like those. Mm, there we go. Those are very nice. I guess if you compare these to like a bag of, of like cheese puffs cheese or something like those. Um, yeah. That's probably about the same, about $2. Yeah, that's, I, I like those. I think that has a nice white cheddar flavor. Mm -hmm. It's not, there's no funkiness to it. It's not overpowering. And the, um, the balls themselves are, are they're not they hard. They're, they're good and crunchy, but they're not hard. Right. Yeah. So, yeah, those are good. Yeah. So, these are the same calories. This is the nacho cheese. I'm really looking forward to these. Um, ooh, wow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the they, color. They smell good. That color is something else. Mm, that's good. That's something different than just cheese. Mm -hmm. It's got pepper or... Um, they need to come out with a jalapeno. There's something in there that makes it a little spicier. Jalapeno cheese balls. There we go. It has um, Monterey Jack and Parmesan cheese. Uh, Parmesan's probably what I'm getting. It has dried garlic, dried chili pepper, paprika. Okay, so I am getting pepper. Yeah. Yeah, these are definitely out of the two. These are the ones I would mm -hmm. never have. They have a lot more flavor. Oh yeah, tons more flavor. But I tell you what, the white cheddar surprises me how good they are. For a white cheddar, they're perfect. Because mm -hmm. we've had white cheddar popcorn, it's like, I don't taste anything. <laughs> right. Or or you can go to the white cheddar that it's so overly funky. It, yeah, it's That funky. it ruins it and you don't want it. So this is the uh, the perfect amount without being offensive yeah. either way, you yeah, know? Yeah, that's good. Um, I think both these are good. And I like those too. Yeah, I would, uh, for me to buy again, I would buy the nacho cheese. But I, I really do, I would like them to to see them come out with um, maybe a sriracha or a buffalo or jalapeno to yeah. come out with some other flavors like that. No, I am going to say, uh, the $2 price tag for these, I think is fair. Yes. $3 but is $3 a little $3 much. $3 is too much, yes. $2.99 is too much. Maybe even two fifty. dollars kind of pushing it there because I could go buy a big, huge bag of Cheeto cheese puffs for like two fifty. dollars People have told me that they found the older flavors at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. No, just the regular one. Yeah. yeah. So I mean, yeah, two dollars is fair. I do think three dollars is too much, much. I agree. Uh, but if if you like um, just a little bit more flavor to yours, I would go <laughs> try the nacho because I think yeah, it'll work. They're good. So I will have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.